swear I could not make this up even if I tried. Well, let me explain. I mean, I was at the City of Thrift last week, and I saw this. I thought it was unique. The name itself kind of sold me, because it's a fur sonic <laughs> for you furries out there. Yeah, I mean, th this is something that I'm not even familiar with. I mean, the sides look like it can be hooked up to a rack system or something. I mean, cassette clock radio. And let's take a look at the model number. And it's a model FCR 101. AM 525 to 1680, FM 88 to 108, output 1.2 watts per channel, power source 117 volts, 60 hertz, made in Taiwan. So, yeah. I mean, it's a... I mean, it's one of those where I don't even know why I bought it. Other than the fact that it's a cassette clock radio, which they're not... weren't all that common. And... I mean, for what, I've never even heard of First Sonic. It may have been a cheapo store brand. It may have been some made in China pride crap. Maybe even drugstore. I don't know. So yeah. And when I bought it, the left volume knob was very, very scratchy. And before I plugged it up, I squirted some contact cleaner in it, so it would at least work. So let's turn it on. Semi-lighted dial. The New York City Marathon, one of the biggest in the world, will go on tomorrow despite Tuesday's deadly terror attack. Race direct. At his sales studios, this is WRD FM Oak Grove, WRD AF Fort Campbell. Playing amazing variety from the 70s, 80s, and 90s for Clarksville, Hopkinsville, and Fort Campbell. Obviously, the dial's off because the indicator looks like 96.1, and that was 94.3, so dial's off a bit. I mean, it sounds pretty good, but I don't know. And I found a tape. It was probably the tape in that tape recorder that I got that I showed off some videos ago. And interestingly enough, this tape deck's almost like the one in your your aftermarket car stereo. So here goes nothing. got chewed up. Unbelievable. Well, I know that don't work. <laughs> so, yeah. Probably needs work. Yeah. Oh, well. Probably just for a novelty purpose.
So yeah, I'm going to conclude this video of the first Sonic clock radio cassette thing. It'll probably just be used as a prop for a cheesy movie or something. So I guess until next time, I'll ask you thanks for watching. Bye.